One of the subjects that I covered a lot were, were buybacks and the nature of share repurchases in markets. And to me, it was always just a quantitative thing. Here's how much they buy back. Here's what they've bought back in history. Here's what they say they're going to buy. Here's the effect it has on earnings. And I never even really thought about it as like a political thing. And then all of a sudden, it's like every news outlet wants to write about buybacks from a political perspective. And I was like, are you kidding me, guys? None of you even cared about – and I'm not talking about the financial news sources. It was everywhere. And it still is becoming this political tool. A lot of this kind of came out of the tax cut, and it wasn't that hard to just kind of look at the numbers, look at the data, say, okay, there was a massive rise in buybacks, but it's a trend that's been going on for 10 years. Is this year's annual change in the buyback rate something alarming or going to destroy the American economy? I don't know, but it's just an extension of a trend, basically.